Losers finals here with Bro Bear and G Man, the Cosmic Destroyer. Loser taking third place, winner advancing to the grand finals. Ring on Duck Hunt for the first round. Personally, I think it's a straight upgrade for that thing. I love all of its sort of miniature thing. Bro Bear tripping on the banana. Not too much follow up. But we got a hoop, a hop, and then another hop. Hop. Up to tilt on the top of the tree. Instantly puts the G-Man in a very scary situation. Hello everyone, this is Jaxus, joining commentary. So far we've got a... Yeah, start of game one. Going to the duck hunt, what do you think about this stage? Huh? I'm honestly not sure. I feel like it's neither of the characters' like best stage by any means. I basically consider it FD with a few no extra advances, but uh, I know that FD isn't particularly good for either of them, but it's also not particularly bad. Um, they both, their main thing on FD and other flat stages is they just have amazing landing traps. However, both characters also have. Uh, did he side B and CSS's down B to totally get out of these situations? Alright, that's it. Uh, I suppose the ducks here could come into play with blocking a banana or uh, uh, they can block. Banana is the big one, but uh, ZSS, if you say Nair and then go for a different follow up, if you hit the duck, then it lasts for a while. Yeah, that's true, that's true. Anything that has a hurt box. And the I guess I should probably clarify. The Nair lasts longer, so the follow up isn't guaranteed anymore. Uh, Paralyzer will do the same thing. And occasionally you can use them for better orders uh, to extend, like, ZSS or Diddy with this custom's up B. Oh, accidentally does the wall kick. And then, or the wall flip, and then kicks early instead of up being. Looks pretty fancy, but not quite effective. Yeah. Spot yeah. dodging the up smash. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Even after the nerf, that still combos insanely well. It does, it's just not quite as much damage. Anymore. Yep, and it doesn't kill in like seven days, so <laughs> that's, <right. laughs> that's nice. Really makes Diddy Kong not quite as scary to play. Still super good though. Oh, so it definitely oh. has her own hoo -hahs. Misspaced the up B, so it didn't actually connect all the way through, and they weren't quite high enough for that to carry them off. Oh, the duck ate the banana. <laughs> I'm, going to assume that was a, I'm going to assume that was a tech error. That's something I see a lot of ZSS players, myself included, do fairly often is you go for the up B and just get the side B instead because you're trying to do the up B that advances forward. Right. Good uh, punish against the down B again. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Yeah, G Man's been doing pretty well about punishing those so far. Yep, uh, it has invincibility frames, I believe, all the way up until the, the apex of the jump. Uh, it's actually for about the first third of it. Okay. It's like the first three little flip after images, those are all intangible, and then after that, ooh, but the fair will kill. Good work, Pro Bear taking game one on the hunt. He doesn't mind too much. Still claps for his opponents. Very enthusiastic. Uh, <laughs> Alright, looks like G-Man's being risky, taking the ZSS Delfino. 
tell that this is a very good stage for both of them. It basically comes down to whoever grabs the other, like as far as the stage playing into it, whoever grabs the other uh, during one of the transitions where the blast zones shrink massively. However, Diddy has a much easier time landing the grab, so I think I agree with this choice. Uh, Zero Suit does have some, some uh, setups into grab tomorrow, though, with a uh, neutral B or, or down smash, or sometimes you can get a grab out of a landing there. Yeah, uh, Diddy on the other hand also has bananas and that whole thing. Right, bananas are excellent for just that. As we saw right there, it didn't actually stop the attack, but it did at least get him out of a follow up. that could possibly come into play in the stage is the water, uh, which to me seems to favor uh, characters with good uh, dare spikes, such yep. as Diddy, because you can just ZSS. spike them into the water and then do it again. Oh yeah. ZSS, uh, the spike that matters for her is the down B. If you time the flip kick correctly, then it will spike. And I'm pretty sure that's powerful enough that it kills zero in the water. The problem wow. is actually setting it up. They have to be pretty deep in the water to give you time to do that. Is it that strong? I know no, Gensor's spike strong. doesn't, doesn't uh, kill instantly in the water. It takes it a couple of hits. No, it takes, it takes three or four hits from, from yeah, zero. Then maybe it doesn't, but I know it's incredibly early when it kills. Force smash not quite fast Ooh. enough. Going for the raw boost kick, but doesn't actually get punished for it. Manages to fall out of Diddy Kong's up smash. It seems to have some odd problems where it doesn't connect all the time. The, the up B. Uh, yeah. We have G Man over here going, aha, uh -huh, every time he jumps. <laughs> Down tilt will take it. G Man does still have the banana though. And. Oh, no. Trying to bait out near dodge, but. Uh, Pro Bear smartly just jumps away. Neither one of them wants to be near the ledge. Yeah, oh, no. do it. Bro Bear gets very close to the ledge there. Great, great reaction oh. to the dash attack. Sometimes it's hard oh. to predict exactly where Thurston's going to go after that. Oh, yeah. oh, the stairs ate the banana there. <laughs> he tried to throw it to punish Bro. The paralyzer. Oh, it doesn't actually get anything out of it though. Juicy just camping on the platform right now. Hmm. It doesn't really pull. Oh, there's an up B. Leads the shield drop. Immediate what? up B. Perfect. All the way across the stage. Uh, it's up tilt very fast. Beats out a lot, a lot of moves. It's uh, frame three and the legs are actually invincible on it. Oh, it's a crazy good move. That's... It has a lot of end lag if it misses. Yeah, that, that's but like so spot boss up tilt is amazing. Oh, neither one of these characters really wants to be above the other, because that, that is how you die. So the top air combos are both deadly for these characters. Yeah. We got a hoop to a hop. Uh, G-Man takes the, the time to pull out a banana. He make good use of it. Ooh, oh, he hits it, but does not connect with the grab. Let's see if G-Man can get down safely, or if he can spike. Nope, he doesn't want to risk it. He saw that he wasn't going to make it, so he just kind of backed off. Right. <laughs> <laughs> A little bit of panic from G-Man here. Panic rolls all the way across the stage. Oh, oh he runs nice. off and bears him. That was a great drop down. Honestly, I wasn't expecting that either. <laughs> G-Man with the accidental wall playing is just... <laughs> <laughs> wow. The animation on that is great. He just looks so alive. And yep. It's like, I'm at the beach, I'm gonna play. <laughs> oh, oh! He gets punished for his silliness. Pops up into the second hit. <laughs> oh, gets the new trailer, puts him above him, but he doesn't actually manage to convert it. ZSS gets back down to the ground pretty... Pretty easily. Uh, her down B is amazingly good for getting her out of trap situations. Because it comes out instantly, it seems. I'm not sure. Quite yeah, sure it's actually in tangible frame 3. So she has a lot of things that are like frame 3 or better. She's got a bunch of crazy get out of jail free stuff. Yeah, frame 1 jab, too. That's amazing. Uh, 
They're kind of at a standstill here. <laughs> oh, no! Uh, oh, oh, oh but he gets out of it. Out. I'm sure you can hear G-Man exclaiming <laughs> on the recording. Bear is going for a lot of uh, paralyzers here. Let's see if the second stock, or if Robert's second stock gets ended with a throw at the ledge too. They've made at least one full rotation of this. Oh wow, I just noticed. Long match, yeah. Time is almost out. Whoa! I want to say too crazy. Oh, CSS uh, flip kick bounces off the banana. Is there quick roll up back on the stage? Nobody wants to be off the stage right now. Oh, Robert very... smartly waiting for the air dodge. Uh, he's been doing really good at about avoiding Diddy's traps there. Like, he's not air dodging, he's jumping out instead. Or when he is air dodging, he's waiting for the attack. That's game, though. Eight seconds, seconds left in the match. Yeah, the, the time coming down. That, often, uh, that was not players. a matchup I would ever have expected to go near time. <laughs> yeah, two very, two, very one fast. one in a best of five set. Two very fast, often aggressive characters, but still. Almost going to we actually don't seem to see that very often here at the Smash Fest. Yeah, no. Time is a very rare occurrence here. <laughs> Generally, people are like. There's like a dollar on the line. I'm gonna go in. <laughs> and then there's also a lot of characters that just legitimately work a lot better going in. Right. What's up? Alright. Yeah. <laughs> So here we go, game three, Robert and Versus. Looks like uh, Robert counterpicks Smashville. It is definitely a good stage for ZSS. Um, I feel like it's not as good as like Town and City and a couple others though. I would agree with that. I think this stage actually seems very neutral to me for both characters. Oh, this stage is actually really good for Diddy. Though I guess, sort of like ZSS, it's really good, but not like the best. I wonder if he decided to stay away from Town and City because he was worried about Diddy's upgrade, but G-Man doesn't seem to really be needing it. Yeah, I don't think he is connected with it. I haven't seen him go for it in quite a while. Ooh, the footstool! Gets him up near the top of the screen, but nothing happens there. Manages to get back down. ZSS is down smash. Well, it has a huge start- up. Ooh, boost kick out of shield. But while it has a huge startup, uh, it's really low lag, like to the point where it's safe on block. Yeah, this is pretty crazy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, uh, I think force man killing Zerosu pretty early there. Yeah, that was crazy. Like, it sounded like the players were super confused as well. Zerosu, uh, despite being so tall, actually pretty light. Yeah, it is. Oh, oh, no punish oh, on the down smash. Musta not realized that it connected until too late, but he didn't die from it anyways. I thought he was going to. Robert should maybe take some tips from Nairo, a well known suit <laughs> player who. Gets, he has crazy punishes. Yes, often he gets a, a down B spike or otherwise a kill from the down B off of a down smash. Yeah. Uh, there's a fair to take the Yep. Yeah. Yeah. G-Man doesn't have a banana in hand right now, though that... I don't know, he seems to be going for that a lot more than I normally see him do it, which is honestly pretty smart. Uh, ZSS, the only weakness she really has is if you, like, force her to grab. She, she has no trouble with shields, but, oh, are we gonna see it? No, we're not, okay. Uh, Broker likes to throw out that up smash a lot, uh, debate. To, uh, to bait air dodges often because it lasts so long. Yeah, it, it covers, covers an enormous amount of barrier. Mm -hmm. uh, he seems to be getting good use of it against the Rob player earlier too. Oh, once again, not quite confirming off of the down smash. I think sometimes he's just not confident enough. He doesn't realize that he has the stuns. Yeah, and if your reaction time is not up to par, then you have to be like you have to know ahead of time when you hit it. And even if your action time isn't really good, it's a super tight window. Especially since it, like, looks very similar if you hit them or if you hit their shield. Yeah, the, the stun animation is not really 
have it landed, so just kind of stand there and shake a little bit. Yeah. Ooh, and the back and air will take strong. it. Very strong. It's stronger kill moves. Definitely. So it's 2-1 for Bro Bear. Let's see where we're going. Going into game 4. Do the... Okay, this is fine. Going to game one. Game four. What's the score? 2-1 uh, bro bear at the moment. Uh, the games are watching for the Hi. Hello. Oh, you. Better than earlier. Good. That's what I was checking. <laughs> I didn't know- I don't think this counts, but I had fun on the CPU. I dared, he got spiked in the stage, didn't tech, dared, spiked in the stage, didn't tech, dared, okay. spiked in the stage, didn't tech, got 157% because of it. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Because <laughs> if you don't tech it, it's just, you can keep jumping, short hopping into it. Alright, well, getting into this match, looks like uh, G-Man decided to counterpick to Pokemon Stadium. I've actually seen him take people here a decent amount. He used to take me here pretty reliably. Until. Uh, there was a spin uh, two weeks ago, and he hasn't taken me there since, but honestly, I feel like this is a fairly good stage for Diddy Kong, just because he's so mobile that he can fly around everywhere, and if he really wants to, he can probably just ledge cancel monkey flip for days off those platforms. And if you get trapped on the platforms, his up air more than covers it. The only thing I could see uh, the stage not working in favor of Diddy, I suppose, is on the steel transformation of the uh, the treadmill the, one with the treadmill. Ah, uh, uh, the electric can, one. Can, oh, the, the electric one. Yeah. That's right. You can take the. Uh, Take the banana off stage. With that. that it can, but on the other hand, if he has center stage, he can throw the banana out behind him and the treadmill takes it to the opponent. That's true. And that's, uh, he also has peanuts, so he can just kind of sit there and be like, approach me. But if he's off stage, then he also has an easier time than most. <laughs> <take the stage. laughs> Did he look so confused? <laughs> like, what am I doing? Here's the ground transformation, the only transformation of the stage that I don't hate. I don't think anybody. It's interesting. A lot of players play it like it's uh, the tree or the rock transformation in melee. But this one, actually, the layout of the platforms makes it easier to approach. Like it's not quite as easy as normal, but it's not really all that difficult. It actually gives the approaching player a decent number of options. Where? But you you really have to know how the stage works, and a lot of players just don't because it's way not very like common. here <laughs> and nowhere else ever. And I'm sorry, Jax, I agree. Oh, yeah, I, I can understand that. Honestly, the main reason I have it legal here is because, I guess my argument with it is, prove to me that this is more broken than Halberd, and I'll get rid of it. <laughs> so I think, once Halberd I think Halberd is a good stage. I don't, Certainly. but... So anyways. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. oh, oh, and the... Uh, Offstage, neutral beat to down. Of the, uh, little, like, now, the, like, Uh, yeah, that's a, it's a weird slope. It really is. On both sides, apparently. Yep, uh, G-Man needs to find a way to close out the stock. Uh, if he gets a solid read, he has a number of options to do so, or if he, like, lands banana to up for example, he has his own boost kick, so... Except that it doesn't carry you, it just kills <laughs> Yeah, it doesn't need to. There's no way to get it. Ice transformation, people are going to be slipping around a ton even without the banana, though they won't be tripping. At least there's no random tripping. Yeah, yeah. This is very cool. Oh, dash attacks and goes actually under the paralyzer shot. He does end up getting punished for it, though. G-Man's going to need to start. He's really going to need to close Ooh, out this slide stock. across the stage. Oh, he didn't quite convert on it, because I don't think he expected it. Yeah. Hard to predict. For... Alright. Fourth throw <laughs> kill. I was going to say he probably should have gone for the up B there, because the SS's grab is insanely laggy. But, I mean, looks like he knows best. Oh, boost kick will take the game. Nice work, bro. Wait a sec. Alright, so that's the end of the losing spot. Oh, 
Wait a minute. That was winner's finals and no one updated the score. Alright, winner's finals. G-Man, what was your versus Chari game count?